for Alex to be able to be safe, comfortable, and make the boat go fast over this sort of length of race, as long as the Vendee Globe, you have to be able to rely on an autopilot on board. And so this has always been a really critical part of an Amoka, particularly in a race like the Vendee Globe. So working with the team at Nokia Bell Labs, we developed our own augmentation of the autopilot that we use on board. One of the big parts of that, and that exclusive to this boat and something that we really would never have been able to do without the help of Bell Labs, is we've brought machine learning on board and we're predicting variables. So we're predicting what the boat's going to do in the future. So normally an autopilot would react to what is happening or what's even already happened. Whereas a human, you can feel a lot of things and based on your experience, you kind of know that little bit of nudge or that little acceleration is gonna make the boat do a certain things and you respond to that and it's why you can drive the boat well. So we're trying to replicate that with the autopilot. So to be proactive instead of reactive. The proactive part means that we're predicting variables. So we have an interface that was created by Nokia Bell Labs. We have a variety of different machine learning models here. You can see they're all learning and predicting. And when you go in to the edit mode, you can select what input variables you use. So we have a whole variety of variables coming in and what variable you're predicting. So at the moment, this model is set up to predict heel, but you could predict apparent wind angle, you could even predict roll rate or yaw rate or acceleration, and use that however you wanted within the autopilot to make it more adaptive, more proactive, and more like a human. And this is something that's made an incredible difference on board Hugo Boss.